And one more thing, the last for the year. Let's find out, shall we? Music Man bass and this is my uh, unit now pimped with the final shape preamp very soon I will uh, put out a demo uh, so that you can hear the difference uh, on how to maximize your Clifton and now we have a mini bass from Clifton uh, to be honest with you guys, I'm not a fan of mini basses because uh, if you are you have been playing bass for how many years, you are used to this actual scale length, very far from the standard uh, 34 inch scale. Um, so let's uh, let's get into it. So the body is Polonia. Just like the the P bass and uh, the Music Man basses, and it, according to the Clifton specs, it has a rosewood fingerboard, satin maple neck, standard tuners, precision style pickups, and a standard bridge. Very uh, easy controls, volume and master tone that's it so um well since the start of um the quarantine uh, season a, a lot of us are stuck at home and uh this might be a good you know uh substitute for uh younger players probably uh ages um maybe six or se uh, six to ten who wants to uh, learn how to play the bass because uh, this might fit their small hands uh, one thing that, uh, that I would also recommend this bass for probably would be a travel mini bass but uh, uh, on my personal uh, preference I'm not really a fan of uh, miniature bases because first and foremost uh, well the body shape is a little bit weird if you are used to like the P bass and, or the Music Man style uh, body shapes or the jazz bass that has an offset body uh, you will definitely uh, you know um, have uh, to adjust to the mini body shape I'm used to the offset uh, shape it's where I rest my uh, right hand so right now I have to adjust my playing uh, well my playing style or plucking hand so to speak it sports uh, well, a 22 fret uh, fingerboard, rosewood, as they say. So I have set up this base as with uh, any demos that I have done uh, on their bases. So um, only stock strings because the um, it's kind of hard to source out. Uh, set for this kind of bass because of uh, the very short scale uh, spec of this bass so let's get into some of the demo clips and sound clips that, uh, that we can get out from this bass 
as always I'm gonna demo this straight to my Mac uh, via um, my Scarlet Solo and um, straight to the Logic no compressor no EQ just straight raw bass uh, let's see how it sounds like shall we Alright guys, there you have it. You heard the Clifton Mini Bass. Um, I, as I've said on the earlier part of the video, I would highly recommend this for very beginner bass players. Those guys who are starting out uh, children, maybe ages 8 to 10 or 12 uh, because of the size of their hands. If they wanted to start uh, learning the bass uh, that this would suit their hands um, also it could be a travel bass if you want to just bring along a uh, a mini bass that is very uh, lightweight uh, and not uh, bulky easy to throw in the trunk of your car um, this could be it on my preference side as I've said uh, I am not a fan of mini basses also because I'm used to the offset body of uh, the P bass shape or the music man shape uh, or the jazz bass also uh, it's gonna uh, create wrist problems on my uh, plucking hand and right hand uh, uh, position a big thing for me for basses because uh, you know you wanted to enjoy playing the bass without uh, having any injury at all. I've been playing bass since 13, 12 years old. Never did I had any injury on my wrist or carpal tunnel because I'm very uh, aware of my position, uh, how I pluck, uh, where I pluck, uh, and uh, the wrist position. Um, that's a, a big thing for me. So yeah. Um, and I will, uh, I, I do not prefer to use this on a live situation. I'd rather go on their music man or P bass models or jazz bass models. 
that I can use uh, for um, um, live purposes or any session any session work thank you so much guys for um, viewing all my videos and accompanying me as I give out um, base gear reviews throughout the year for you I hope it has helped you on your next base hunt uh, please enjoy this season with your family I know it's the Christmas season uh, 2020 has been really tough uh, for all of us we all just have to view it in another perspective and count our blessings i am really hoping for a better 2021 in a couple of days uh please stay safe and uh, god bless everyone